This season, Persistence wow. turns blue. Equipping it divides the score streaks into three tiers, forcing you to choose one from each. But still guarantees Bruh. you one final trump card late game. Why would you waste your blue slot on Persistence instead of equipping other more useful perks? Codmobile's point system is pretty simple. You get points from kills, objective kills, doing objectives, kill streaks, and sometimes firmer score streaks as well. So how can you play to get higher score streaks? Before anything else, here's how I pick my score streaks. I usually pick UAV, Chalk RC, and Predator Missile just so I can cycle through them really fast. But for today's demonstration, let's go with UAV, Cluster Strike, and Swarm. Let's hop onto a domination and hardpoint ranked match so I can show you just how I play to get consecutive kills for score streaks and hopefully you learn a thing or two. Okay, so we're gonna play domination and we're gonna play to get our score streaks. Domination, capture the so for domination, every point counts and something is better than nothing. So we're gonna capture our flag. Let's capture our home flag. 350 points, easy. So based on the skill feed, the minimap, and your teammates, we're gonna pick the best position to get three to four kills. One, two, three. Well, we got three. Now we're gonna rip position and get out of here. We're gonna pop our UAV. Targets in sight. We lost B, but it's fine. We're gonna play four score streaks for now. Oh my god. Oh my god. I died. I died because I was careless. Okay. We're gonna reset and we're gonna do this again. So that's two. That's four. We got our UAV. We're gonna pop it. And we're gonna get all. We're gonna help our teammate because that's extra points for your score streak. And they're stealing our flag again. We got our airstrike. We got our swarm. We got our swarm. Okay, nice. So we got our score streaks. We did lose the round, but we got our score streaks. So we're going to use that to the best of our abilities. We, we got patient. We played our life. And we tried to hop on the objective while em eliminating enemies. Now that we have our cluster strike, we can use it to deny enemies from capturing a flag. Or we can reserve it by the end game and use it as a kind of a UAV. Let's deny them from B. Let's pop our swarm. I don't care. We got our airstrike again. They're gonna come from here. Friendly airstrike incoming. You may be spotted. Using a problem. over here. Woo! We got our swarm. We got our swarm. Let's use our operator skill. Let's use it to tap the flag. We got him. Nice. Great. That's how you can play to get score streaks without wasting it on persistence. Okay, so moving on over to Hardpoint, I'll show you how I play for score streaks and kills. So, the way I do it is instead of going straight onto the objective, I'm going to find a position where I can cut them off guard while they go to the home point. That's one. That's two. We're just gonna stay around here. They should be spawning lower, but... Yeah. But some might spawn there. Nice. Get down, sniper! Oh my We got sniped. Capture the heart, lost the lead. Oh my gosh. Oh my not again. 
in sight. Let's get a full tree. Come on. So we got a UAV. We're almost there. For our closer strike. Let's get it. We got our strike. We got our closer strike. We got our swarm. We got our full streak. We got the dream. Let's, let's pop the swarm. Okay, we got a swarm. Let's win this. Sometimes, if a hard point acts like, like a hard precision, you can use it yourself. So you can get Enemy more contact. points for four feet. Enemy in sight. Let's get it. Get it. Just get it. Now I want to know how do you get score streaks? Let me know down in the comments below. If you're struggling to get multiple kills in a row without dying, watch this video to learn the key ingredients in getting more kills. And of course, you can learn more about games and tips to make you unpredictable right after. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.